All right. We are going to make a web page, place a file on the web page as a link so that people can click on the link and download the file. Let's say a syllabus. So the first thing we need to do is log in to Web Manager. And a quick refresher is when you go to Capital's website and click on Teacher Tools, then look for the Web Manager link. This will prompt you to log in. I'm already logged in, so I don't need to do that. Also underneath that link, you'll see the Web Manager Tutorials. When you click on this link, it, <clears throat> it will bring you to a page with various tutorials on how to use Web Manager. Uploading and placing is what we're doing right now, and let's get started. So first off, on my account right here, uh, I already have a web page, and I could go in here and do things on it, but I'd rather show you a blank page. So I'm going to create a new page, and I'm going to name it Sample. Then I'm going to edit the page. And what I want to do is create text that I can use as a link to the file that I want people to be able to download. So I'll just say my syllabus. And again, whatever word you want to type is fine. Just highlight the words that you want to turn into a link uh, once you're done typing. Then I click on the chain link icon while this is selected. So just make sure it's selected. Click here. Then I click on this icon over on the side. And what I'm going to do is upload the file. I then choose a file. On my desktop, I have my syllabus. And this could be a PDF file, it could be a Word file, uh, whatever file you want to have uploaded on your site. I click Open, and you'll see the files here. Then I have to click Upload to Server. And I have a lot of files because I see the whole website. You're only going to see your section, so it should be a lot easier. Now when I scroll down, I'll see the syllabus file. And what I have to do is click this box right in front, click Insert, and it puts this text in here. This is the link to the file that I've uploaded. Then I click Insert again, and this has been turned into a link. I click Save Changes, and I'm going to view the page to see what the whole world sees. So when I click on My Syllabus, it will prompt me to download the file. I already have it on the desktop. That's why this one is here. And I'm not going to save it now. But that's how you do that.